Good morning, my friends. We are back with more Season 2 of Spy Family, where this series seems to be like, hey, we have all these interesting side characters. Let's do something with them! So we've been getting some great character explorations, including Yuri, who I think is a difficult character to do a deep dive on because he's so... Off-putting. <laughs> but I think they did a great job of depicting him as, yes, nationalistic, but not completely evil. Just a little evil. Who seems perfectly aware of the circumstances that an impending war entails and how he empathized with someone who was really struggling through it. So I see Anya wandering around in the little thumbnail, so hopefully we'll get to keep doing these like deep dives into these characters for our main cast. So yeah, let's hop in. What a day, ay, 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 ay. Uh oh. The snake's at it again. <laughs> this is. This has to be like Garden of Eden inspired. Oh, so it's not just apples. Okay. That was a cute title card. <laughs> Anya's like so funny for real. Wow, Becky's like, he's going for the Oscar. <laughs> First rule of improv, yes and. Uh oh. I was actually just thinking about, like, reminiscing about how that was, like, the hardest part of middle school is not ending up in classes with any of your friends. Ooh, language studies. The pastry. <laughs> oh, what a convenient exposition. Okay, so if Anya gets this apple, she can be in class with Becky and make Lloyd proud. Okay. Mission set. <laughs> there are two different art styles in <laughs> their faces. Oh my gosh, they are... <laughs> Marathoning it there. <laughs> Dang it. I don't know why that got me. <laughs> I'm so glad we're back with Anya. So could you have split, like, the forbidden fruit in pieces? Look at these kids are evil. <laughs> Damien had finally learned how to chill out as early as two episodes ago, but... Here we are. You're literally bullying this kid. Oh, cause he just a greedy. <laughs> Ooh, who's gonna get left out? Okay, I'm gonna guess it's the swoopy hair kid. Or Becky. Wow. Cards were super banned at my schools. I'm so bad at gambling games, too. <laughs> Damien, you can't be a Stella star being a cheater. <laughs> Starlight Anya time. Oh, they're all cheating. Yeah, I'm like, there's no way she's just that good. I wonder how Damien would react if he found that out. With that 
May that end his little budding crush. She should have just taken the W. <laughs> oh no. Well, she's doing a good job covering her bases. <laughs> I hope he calls her out for that lack of poker face. <laughs> Thank you. What a cute power couple that would be. It's down to the wire. Who will be our elementary blackjack king or queen? Oh, insecure Anya. Not my heart rate going up. <laughs> it's so sad because that because Anya is like trump card it just would never work for me but look at him all flustered like that <laughs> gosh darn it now I like him he's Damien he's a good guy Or maybe he's not a good guy and he just got swindled. It's even more intimate than sharing sake. It's the tsundere for me. What has this macaroon done to her? <laughs> That's Super Saiyan Anya! I think they just stuff these little pastries with Adderall. <laughs> Everyone's disappointed. Hey, was that the nail in the coffin? <sighs> You're so empathetic. Lloyd is like, we're screwed! Aww. Looking on the bright side. Oh, wow, inquisitive. That's a very subtle drop. That's a very interesting subtle drop on some Anya backstory. I feel like Lloyd is always kind of like... He's always like on the verge of a breakthrough with Anya, and then he's like, Ah, never mind. <laughs> Kids are so easy. Doused Industries. Oh, so is this like a part two again? Oh wow, new terrorist group dropped. The Shadow Government. Oh, wow. Okay, so we've got a whole lot of new underground government, garden. There's a lot more happening behind the scenes than I thought. <laughs> I love Frank. Oh, is Twilight just gone? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Uh. This our C plot? That's me! I'm allergic to cats though, so it can't help. Oh, Frank's putting together a whole army for this. All of this just to score a date. It's just any cat. Ooh, is that CGI? Your? Huh? This episode sure is uh, splintering around a lot. Yours actually so cute in her work uniform. Aww. I wonder if that would be uncomfortable for Frank, like having to be on eggshells. Oh. 
Wow. Frank, your team up. Okay. Feeling a little bamboozled because this episode is not about Lloyd at all, but I guess we did just get one. We don't smell the pheromones. Cats are evil. Okay, that's not true. You know that smells rank. <laughs> I feel like I enjoyed Frank and Anya more. This episode's a lot of sitting around, but... <laughs> Maybe I missed it, but how did he even extract that scent? Oh, take one home. Get you get bond a friend. <laughs> the tango. Well, oh, Frank is such a gadget master. Is there a specific point to it being a camera? Of course, Mr. Kobe's being a little brat. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what even is this? He looks like he should be like running around in sewers. So just to go in. Okay, that was just really good timing. Is Frankie gonna report back to Lloyd about that? <laughs> Absolutely mad example of your just... Sometimes not a single thought in there, but she will just get the job done. <laughs> but now he gets the girl, so that was not a wasted decade. Yeah, she's, he's gonna return this cat, and she's gonna Casey's gonna be like, "Oh my gosh, my boyfriend's gonna be so happy." I knew it. A brave face. I don't know. I don't see them making the test of time. I give it a year. <sighs> he did a good thing. Yours like and everything worked out. <laughs> Or whatever, these women are just so toxic, like... Oh, and she takes it as a compliment that's so... Uh, HR! Oh, I hate these people. Why do they keep beating down on her? Makes me sad. <laughs> okay. <laughs> if... if if your if your colleague like every day was like yes I am married like and this is a tonal shift. Ooh. Ah. G gosh yeah I know season one was like a minute ago but if I recall correctly I feel like this season is a lot more relaxed which is a good thing because I kind of like this down to earth aspect of it but it can be like when you fill an entire episode with like the majority of people just kind of like standing or sitting around and that's been the case for i think like two at least two out of four of the episodes this season it can be a little bit like hard to capture attention but this episode stands out in the way that i feel like the comedy was just so strong like the timing was perfect just in like all, like almost all the jokes just hit like it just it just works and so i honestly like i approve that as like a really strong credit of this show but other than that i feel like we didn't learn like 
we didn't really get too much out of this episode. We, it wasn't really like a deep dive in the way that the other side characters have been getting this past three episodes, which is a little bit disappointing, but maybe they feel like that. I mean, I'm sure that's coming, you know? So at least we have this like mission with, we have this mission with your coming up, I hope. So hopefully that lives up to the hype that I'm, I'm building it up to be in my head. So yeah, I kind of see, honestly can't wait to see how this unfolds. So until next week.